when it comes to being in sales or being in business, how can you tell when somebody's a closer versus when they're a poser? I'm Scott Silvan Bell. I'm coming to you live from Sacramento, California. I need a perfect day to talk about sales and a perfect day to talk about how somebody is a closer versus somebody who's a poser. Now, a poser is somebody who's fake and they think that they are what they are. They're pretending to be. They're pretending to be a salesperson. And you're gonna find that closers accept responsibility for whatever they got going on. And this just isn't a small bit of information. It's a huge bit of information. And let's just start at the very beginning. They know that they gotta be on time for the presentation. They gotta give a whole presentation. They gotta ask all the questions. They gotta overcome objections. And then there's all the things that gotta be done on the back end. They gotta do some paperwork. They gotta turn stuff in. Sometimes they don't want to because they're closing so many deals. I know some closers that pay people to do their paperwork for them because it's far more valuable. They're like, why would I do something that's a minimum wage job when I could pay somebody that money to do the work for me? Now, I'm not knocking them paying somebody else to do it. They just know their time value. They know what they're worth. They know what it takes to close some deals. They know what happens if they step away from closing deals. They're dealing with tasks. But you got to know, if you want to be a closer in sales versus somebody who's a poser, you got to accept responsibility. And this also means you got to track your commissions. This also means you got to make sure that if somebody's struggling with a product or service, you find a way to help them. Maybe you pay somebody or you help them out yourself. But here's the thing, you cannot be a great closer when it comes to being in the world of sales if you're not willing to be responsible for your own actions. Like if it is to be, it's up to me. I know I've said that before, but here's the thing, you're going to watch the greatest salespeople walk in, they're going to do what needs to be done, they're gonna keep their promises to their buyers and they are gonna accept responsibility for their actions. They're gonna say, hey look, it's my fault, I screwed up. Now, I've had deals in my own personal life go sideways and I have this belief, if something happens, I'm gonna to run towards the problem instead of run away from it. And you're gonna find that when something goes wrong in the world of sales, that person said, hey look, I paid you commission, I wanna make sure that you're gonna be there for me every step of the way. And this is one of the things that I tell people. If by chance something goes sideways, I'm gonna be there every step of the way for you. You got my number, you got my email, whatever it takes to make things happen. And I've had people call me and say, hey look, I need some help. And that's what they're looking for, a real pro a real pro versus someone who's a Joe is gonna go, hey, look, I gotta fix this for you, I'm gonna get it taken care of. Instead of just like, here, here's an 800 number, call somebody, call somebody who cares. Well, that should be you. You gotta take responsibility for your actions, okay? I'm gonna let you know that you are gonna get your clock cleaned by somebody who is willing to take responsibility for their actions, they just carry themselves differently. The person knows, they feel, they feel it, right? I and mean, you've probably sat down with a buyer, there's probably a time when a buyer says, you know, I had a sales guy come out here and make me a bunch of promises that he couldn't keep. Right? It happens in every single industry. Your job is to accept responsibility and explain why you're better. That will make you a closer and not a poser. Now, you got one thing to do from here. Just one thing. Find the subscribe button, click on it, and every time I send out a video, you'll get an update that says Scott Bell Consultant sent out a video, which I do frequently. So, you should check it out. That's true. We'll see you soon. Aloha.